Is 100 millimeters per second too slow? Do you crave high-speed engraving? Do you often envy other people's engraving machines? Don't envy. In fact, we can also do it. Let me teach you how to do this. How much speed can we break through? Depending on the x-axis structure of the engraving machine and the weight of the laser. The x-axis structure of S6, S6 Pro, and S9. When engraving at high speed, it is prone to shaking. Therefore, it is not recommended to exceed the default maximum speed. Machines that use linear guides, the x-axis is more stable. Therefore, it can break through the maximum speed. And the lighter the laser weight, the stronger the stability, the higher the speed that can be broken through. Suggested maximum speed and acceleration settings. 11 watt and below. How to break through. Lasers weighing less than or equal to 11 watts have a lighter weight, stronger stability, and can break through higher speeds. It is recommended not to exceed 25,000 mm per minute. Twenty watt and above. How to break through? Lasers with a weight of twenty watts or higher are heavier, more susceptible to inertia, and have poor stability. It is not recommended to exceed higher speeds, and it is recommended not to exceed eighteen thousand millimeters per minute. Frequent high-speed engraving requires attention to rail maintenance. It is recommended to use liquid lubricants such as WD-40. Not only can it lubricate the guide rail, it can also prevent rust. 